This video is going to show you how to calibrate your MRW washdown scale. The first thing you do is you press the zero button and the on-off button and that brings up the calibration menu. And now we're going to be entering our scale's capacity weight. And this is a 15 pound scale so we're going to be entering pounds first. To do that you press the unit key and it's on pounds but to change that you can press the unit key again to kilograms back to pounds. Now to confirm that you press the pieces button and it's confirmed. Now you press the pieces key again to go to the next menu. And now we're ready to enter our scale's weight which is 15 pounds. So you press the unit key again and you can see it says 15. Now if you wanted to change the digit on the left here you press the zero button and that will bring it up or down or if you need to move the digit from the left to the right you press the unit key and that will move it to the right. See? But we're at 15 pounds and we're going to press the pieces key to confirm that. And we're going to press the pieces key again to move to the next menu. And now we're going to be entering the weight that we're going to use to calibrate and I'm going to be using two kilograms. So I'm going to press the unit key and it's on kilograms but to change that you press the unit key again pounds back to kilograms and press pieces to confirm that and then pieces again to move to the next menu. And we're going to be using two kilograms so we're going to enter that by pressing the unit key. You can see these flashing digits here. Again to move this digit up or down to one, two, or three press the zero button and to move the digit from the left to the right press the unit key. You can see that's flashing. We're at two kilograms so we're going to press the pieces key to confirm that. Now we're going to press the pieces key again to move to the next menu. And now we're on our division menu. And to get to your division, you just look here on the bottom, and on my scale it says .005, that's the division. Your scale might be different. To change that, you press the unit key, and there's mine, .005. Press the unit key again, and you can see that there's several different selections. But we're using this one, and we're going to confirm that by pressing the pieces key. Okay, and then we're going to press the pieces key again to the next menu which is our inter ADC, our internal resolution menu. Now we're going to hit units to select our internal resolution. And our scale is 21, but if you need to change that, you press the unit key again. There's 18, 19, 20, and back to 21. And we're going to press pieces to confirm that. When you see it says ADC, you press the zero button. And it's going to bring up the AD value. Wait for the stable indicator. Then press the unit button. It's going to start flashing in a second. Okay, now it's ready for the weight. I'm going to put two kilograms on there. Wait for the stable again. Press the unit button. Wait for the series of lines. There it is. Now the scale is calibrated. Now to save that, you press the off button. And now your calibration is saved.